Hold on. Hold on. Are we adding? Well, yeah, are we gotta, adding I, to the Thompson I've list? Gotta, yeah, I've got to add. I've got to add one because I, off the top of my head, I was like, you know, but he's he was on my he played for my my Kansas City Chiefs. And I met Marcus <laughs> Allen. I was a huge fan of Marcus Allen because he played for the Chiefs. I met him. He was a little bit of a douche, a little bit of a douche, man. I was actually I was kind of like heartbroken. I'm like, man, you're such a good fucking. And there's I don't want to tell you why, but he just uh, he had a thing about him. He just was very very douchey. Okay. Um, then Barry Bonds, he legitimately oh. tried to charge some child fucking forty dollars for a fucking autograph. Well, yeah, okay. I can, I, I, can, I, can ex- I can, I can, I can give you weird. stories about me and Barry Bonds, so it's, special it, stories it, at it weddings. Really, <laughs> we, we were at we were at like a charity event, and this dude legitimately asked a kid for forty bucks for an autograph. Yeah, you got forty <laughs> bucks. And I thought he was joking, and no, no, they just walked away from the kid. I was like, wow, I'd heard of this stuff happening. I'd never seen it happening though. Yeah, I'd never seen it happen. I saw it happen. I was like, "Wow!" And then last night was Jean Claude Van Damme. <laughs> and so hold have... on. So what you're saying is that JCVD mm-hmm. has made the Josh Thompson top mm-hmm. three douchebag yeah. award list. <laughs> yeah. Okay. There's a lot of fun. I've met a lot, a lot of professional athletes, and I've met a lot of actors and actresses. So have I. And it was it was the strangest thing to me, John. I walked up and I saw him. Hit, and, you know, we were chatting with some other people, and I reached across. And I go, "Hey, man, I go, would you? I like to get a picture with you and get a chance." Didn't say one word. He just grabbed my phone out of my hand, and he couldn't figure just out. Just big how to brothered use, you. Just couldn't figure out how to use the settings. It just big so brother. Whoever you, man. was with him, his assistant or somebody, like got it on portrait and reversed the camera and all this stuff. And then he takes the picture and handed it back to me. So weird. Didn't say anything. Didn't say one word. Didn't say hi. Didn't say sure. Didn't say well, anything. Just a very strange, strange. Didn't smile either. It was a very awkward situation. And I was like, Meh. all right, you're one of those guys. I get it. You're what one you of those guys. Should, now, I've, see, I've met hold Steven it. What you should have done. Oh, I know. I don't see a barrel. What you should have done is you should have looked at him, taken the picture, looked at him, and gone, a race. <laughs> so weird to me man I'm like i i think i think a lot of like a lot of people forget especially the ones that are like that they forget that your grave is still six feet deep just like my motherfucker like, oh yeah that's Dude. the thing we still put our your pants still, on one leg at a time your shit yeah, smells your the same stink. man yeah there you it, go. All stinks. Stinks. it all stinks that's it it just was a very weird situation <clears throat> you know um my dad was a big fan of john claude van damme and steven seagal my dad used to love and eat up those movies man. oh he really loved them and uh, so meeting after all these years of have met Steven Seagal, you know, meeting uh, John claude Van Damme last night. And I had seen him before in an event. I think it was a UFC event a long time ago. I had met him before there, but just in passing. And I never really like to get pictures with people. I don't want to bother him. Um, I was like, you know what? He was there. He was sitting in front row at the event. I was walking past and we were in a group of people talking. I was talking with Chuck. I was talking with Dan and he was there. And so we were all kind of chatting. I was like, you know, I just asked him real quick. Anyways, but he's made my list, man. But I will tell you this. I want to end this on the positive note. Let's hear the positive. The positive note is not about him or not about anything. Else. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not saying this about your your current addition to the uh, the DB list. Mm-hmm. But I, I've known him and everybody. He's a douchebag, man. He's a, just an idiot. Who's but, this? John Claude Van Damme. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, just just not a good human being. Wow. But 